guys, I'm going to be telling you a story about how I got in a fight with my best friend's ex-friend. So, like, this was, like, probably, like, I think last, like, Friday. On Friday, yeah. So, like, yeah. So, like, apparently, so, like, I was, like, going to my friend's house and stuff. And, um, she really wanted, she told me, she texted me on iMessages that she wants to get in a fight with somebody. And I was like, girl, who are you going to get in a fight with somebody? Like, who is it? And, like, we have a whole group chat and stuff. And then she said she's going to tell us in the group chat. So, like, we were in the group chat and stuff. When we were in the group chat, she said that, um... Her ex-friend is named Jolene, Jolene, yeah, Jolene, and her ex-friend Jolene betrayed her when she was like, yeah, I'm wearing my mom's wig, I don't know, but I stuck this on, and then she put, like, weird, yeah, spongebob things on it, and then, and then after that, the group chat was like, oh my god, and then our group chat is like some boys and girls, and we came to her house, like, she was like, kind of next to Woodbridge, what is Woodbridge, no, I don't know where she lives, but she kind of lives next to me, in the gardens and stuff, I don't know where she, but I forgot the location, <laughs> so like, we went to her house, and when we went to her house, she was like, all beat up with bruises on her. And I was like, who is that person beating you up? Because, like, do me, right? So then, so then, Jolene, she was actually um, hiding from us. So then, when I saw Jolene, Jolene was like, so, are we just going to find this stuff? And then Jolene, she didn't, be, she didn't have a time to touch me. No time to touch me. So then, when she tried to touch me, I was like, back off. Back off. And then she was like, oh, I'm not scared of you. I'm not scared of you. But then I punched her right in the face. Yeah, I'm sick, guys. Don't be my boy. And after that, um, her, Jolene's mom came because she called her mom. And then after that, Jolene's mom came and tried to fight me. When I was at my friend's house, I was like, why are you trying to fight me? Why is you trying to fight me? And then well, she said that why she's trying to fight me because she has no other choice to fight. So, like, that's why she was trying to fight me. And then, like, she was, like, fighting me because she had no other choice. So then I was like, why are you fighting me if you don't have another choice? You could just go somewhere instead of fighting me. And she says, oh, are you scared that I'm bigger than you? And I'm like, are you calling yourself fat? <laughs> and, like, I would bring my friend Mula with me. But, like, my friend doesn't know her. So, like, that's why I didn't invite him. Anyways, let's go back on the video. So then... After that, they both got so mad at me for fighting. I was like, why is you guys so mad? Like, I didn't even do nothing. All I was trying to do is help my friend out and do all that. And let me show you guys something real quick that they gave me. I mean, I'm going to show you guys something I ordered really good. So, it's like something you can fight with. Just took a sip of water. And let me show you guys. It's like these seashells. These seashells right here. So, like, you might be like, why do you have seashells to fight with? So, like, these are really hard to slap it, like, ow. It looks like I didn't even slap it. Like, if I do this, it's still gonna burn. And, like, I already burned myself. And, like, I slapped her with these. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if she was mad or not. I don't know, but, like,. She was like, girl, why would you do that? Water break. Back to the video. And like, shoot. And then like, after that, I left the house and my friend came with me. And she told her mom and her mom wanted to bring me somewhere with her. And this thing is hurting me right now. So like, I'm taking
and then I was like, oh, hold up. Y'all better stop fighting because there's no time to fight. And it's like, they're both looking at me like, and like, I'm going to get another way my mom is. Because this wig is much comfortable. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to put it on me. <laughs> much comfortable. So then, and after that, my friend, so like, my friend gave me this broken thing that her friend broke. I'll show you. It's like from Christmas. She sent this from 1999. And, like, my friend, like, she gave me it. And I was like, girl, I don't, what do I need this for? And then she said, to protect yourself, bestie. Bestie, to protect yourself, bestie. I was like, girl, I don't know what you're talking about, but, like, I don't need this. So then I just took it home with me. And apparently, this is supposed to be, like, walking in your house. Or something, and I didn't believe that. And I said, just check, check the security cameras. This was not walking in the house. And then I went back to her house that day, and she said, I told her this doesn't walk in your house. And she said, well, it's just a little gift for you for your birthday, and I forgot to give it to you. This broken thing is for my birthday, and I was grateful. Right? I don't know why I'm talking about that. And then the next day, we went back to Jolene. We went. Jolene, she is a like grief. She, um, yeah, grief. And we went to her school because she has school on Saturdays. I mean, on Fridays. I don't know, but I don't know. We went to her um, school, and then that day, her school was like full with people doing this. Everybody was couple fighting. And this is just this light. And I was like, why am I here? Like, why am I here? Why is, why am I here? My friend, me and my friend had to walk. Walk. Like, when I say walk, we had to walk. And I was like, my legs were hurting. My legs were burning up. And I did not like that. This, I mean, like, let me tell you something. This also happened on October 2022, and I was like, Hurr. it also happened. I was only like six years old, and um, I was only six years old. I was still six, and I was still six years old. And we're not gonna talk about that. We're gonna talk about that in a in a little bit later. So then, when we went there, I would look, I ran out because they were all looking like. Like that. And I was like, why are they all looking at me like that? Like, hello? So then the answer why they were looking at me like that. They said because they had no choice. No choice? Okay. And I'm taking off this wig and putting that back. And like, they said, they had no choice. So like, you had no choice. Why didn't you just tell her that you had no choice? And you could have just not fight us. But like, instead you wanted to fight us? Like, hello, boo boo bear. And I was like, mm, please don't fight me because I don't want to, I don't have the time to fight. I really don't have the time to fight. I really didn't have the time to fight. And like, when we were fighting, my friend, she jumped right in. She jumped right in. Like, when I say right in, she jumped right in, and I was like, girl, you want to die? You want to die, girl? And she said, like, I'm not going to die. I'm going to be okay. And, like, I was like, you going to be okay? Remember the last time, a long time ago, your face was full with blood. Blood. It was. And then, I didn't know why your face was full with blood. I think it's because, like, they were beating each other up. And I'm like... I was crazy. No, I'm not kidding you that. No. And like, gosh. Just like, and they were like fighting and fighting and fighting. I went out and my friend was like, look, let me show you the way she was walking right next to me. It's so like, let me, like, it was like this. She was like this. Like, right there. And I was like, girl, stop. Just annoy the background. It's my little brother and my mom fighting. And when they were fighting, I was looking like, 
And I was so mad, because, like, she was so mad, because, like, I wasn't helping her to fight. And that wasn't my problem, because, because, and I was like, oh, my God, stop fighting with me. Uh, and she said she was going to fight me next, and I was like, girl, be quiet. And, um. Then she was mad at me, and she went home, and I went home, and um, she texted me, saying, why would you not help me? And I was like, I'm not going to fight those people. Mm-mm. Not today. And she said that she's going to try to make me fight them. And I said no, because... There's no point in fighting people I don't want to fight. And I didn't want to fight them because I felt like I didn't have to. And I felt like I didn't want to be her friend anymore because, like, she kept forcing me. And I was like, okay, how about we could do? We don't look at those people again. We don't um, be their friends anymore. Or we are never their friends. And then she made a deal. And her mom said that, come on, let's go to the mall and get some ice cream and get some stuff. And then we did. Oh, my God. I literally got a necklace with my name. <laughs> and it was like, <laughs> I was so happy. My friend, she only got, like, ice cream. And then we got more. And we got, like, Auntie Annie's. We got Auntie Annie's. She loves Auntie Annie's. And I gave her some of my Auntie Annie's. And then she put the ice cream on my nose. Then I put the ice cream on her nose. But then for some reason, Jolene was literally at that mall. Jolene was literally at that mall. When I said literally at that mall, she was literally at that mall. And I was like, why is Jolene at the mall? And like, I really like, I really like that to her. And my friend was like, told her mom, and her mom literally fight those kids, and they never came back. Um, but Jolene still had those bruises. Um, she broke her arm. She broke this, so she broke like right. So like, her. Let me show you. So her arm's broken right here to down there. <laughs> And, um, I was helping Julian, and I let her go on my, um, I let her have a piggyback on me, and, and, um, we got Auntie Annie's again, then we went back to the mall, because uh, my, her mom forgot her, um, um, her wallet, but she didn't forget her wallet. She was shooking us so she could get more stuff. Then we got more clothes, and, um... After that, after that, and yeah, that's like what happened. But you guys gotta come back for part two.